Yo! What's up, guys? Guys. Um, so today, I heard from my friend Lulu that I have a new fan. A fan. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> um, so I wanted to shout out Ricky. I'm going to link his channel down below. Um, I can't see anything. I can't see anything. So much water. So at the bottom of my driveway, here I'll show you guys. So at the bottom of my driveway, there's like a little, we don't have a drain. It's just like a little dip. Okay, now I have to go drive. Um, let's see. That's my house. Okay. At the bottom of my driveway, there's a little dip. And look how much water there is. It's really deep. So anyway, when I was um, just backing out, I couldn't see damn near anything. So, <sighs> what was I saying? Anyway, hey Ricky. I'm going to link his channel down below. He does Fortnite. Um, I hope it doesn't bother you guys that I'm sight sort of slanted. Does that bother? Does that bother? How's that? That's better. Whatever. Um, Wow, today was a long day. Okay, so first of all, it's day four of Ramadan. So I've been fasting. I've been doing this since I was in first grade. Um, so it's no big deal. It's way easier being in Florida because the days aren't as long as they are when you're farther up north of the equator. Um, because science. And so like day one was like the best day and usually day one's like the hardest but like day one was pretty easy for me it was a monday so i worked all day went to the gym like did light stuff came home pretty much was able to eat right away um so the, the only hard thing was like i didn't realize that after i finished eating my breakfast which is before the sun rises after i was done eating breakfast and stuff i wasn't gonna have time to go back to sleep and I was up late watching hockey. So th that was the tough part, was just like being tired and like I could tell I was really sleepy all day, but the hunger wasn't bother didn't bother me. Second day, um, felt a little bit more hungry because I, like when I, when I don't eat a lot, when I don't eat all day and I'm hungry and I do eat, I'm like, at that point, I'm so hungry that I'm nauseous, so I don't want to eat. So, I didn't eat enough Monday night, and then I again Tuesday morning, like I wasn't feeling like eating. So I didn't eat enough Tuesday either. So I had a headache pretty bad on Tuesday, um, and I worked um, a serving job. So that that was a little wrong. Day three yesterday um, was it? bad. Um, my headache wasn't as bad. I took a vitamin B, um, which is supposed to give you like extra energy and stuff, um, like throughout the day. Um, I can't tell if I'm supposed to go or not. Okay. Um, but yeah, so like, now today, I'm starting to feel like hungry, but it's not that bad, okay? Honestly, like it's not that bad. Right now it feels like I'm hungrier right now than I was the last few days, but I'm probably similar. And it's mostly like, I'm so thirsty. <laughs> it makes you feel like you should Being thirsty is way more impactful than being hungry. And no, I can't drink water either. So, um, and yes, it's bad for you, but it's actually not as bad for you as you think. And, uh, like, like, the point is not everybody has the luxury of getting everything they need and stuff. Um, and it just humbles you. It humbles you down and makes you realize, like, honestly, the thing that I realize the most when I'm fasting is how often I 
and others complain throughout the day about nothing. About things like, like just, it, it's, you're, you just want to hear yourself talk, like, it, at some point, you know, like, or like there's dead air and you're just like, well, I might as well complain about something. It's sort of like in your mind. It doesn't seem like that's what you're doing on purpose, but that's what you're doing. I don't know. Like I realize act like of that of myself every year when I fast. So like it's a good reset button. But the worst thing about today wasn't that I was hungry. Is that I was starting to get like my irritability now is starting to be a factor. It's raining so hard. I bet it is so loud on camera. That's crazy, but um, yeah, uh, it's it's pretty intense. The the irritability. And what's exhausting about it is like I think I did a really good job today of even though I was irritable and like a lot of things that were irritating me weren't even like re like they were things like really other people should have been doing better or whatever um it was more so like I realized I'm only being cranky because I'm hungry probably or like how would things be different or like don't let everybody else's like bad mood kind of put you in a bad mood too even though that's exactly what it did but I wanted to make sure I didn't like lash out at people just to make them feel bad because I'm really good at being a smart ass um but I don't want to have to make people feel like a dumbass just because I can't because it doesn't do anything for me and it doesn't do anything but hurt their feelings so if if all it's gonna do is make me feel like good about myself because like I I could you know say something smart and bitchy for like a second of satisfaction it's just not worth it so I I did a really good job of keeping it in but damn it's exhausting it's really exhausting to to like want to bitch at people and then just hold it in all day like I don't know I could have said so many mean things I did let it get to me at the end, though. This one girl that... <laughs> this, everybody has that one person that always le gets to leave work on time or early, you know? And so there was this girl, and it was like, you know... It was like around the time when most people would... Like, most clinics would be, like, wrapping up and stuff, and this one girl was, like, still working. And she usually, like, leaves early. Like, I swear, she usually is, like, out the door by... Like, she is, like, leaving by 4 o'clock, or she's, like, gone by 3.30. I don't know. When I, anyway, so, it was funny. I, I did I did let one of my smart-ass comments out. She was, she was, like, doing faxing or something, and I was, like, you're here late. <laughs> she was, like, what do you mean? I'm here late. It's only 4 o'clock. And I was, like, exactly. <laughs> anyway, so, that's my spiel for the day. If you think you're irritable and you think you deserve to take your anger out on people, just think about it for a second and, you know, you should be the reason why people have a better day, not the reason why people have a worse day. Or at least you shouldn't contribute to the reason why people have a bad day because nobody likes having a bad day. And whenever somebody makes your day fucked up, you don't, <laughs> sorry, my language, um, you don't like it and you wish that person would have never been born. So don't be that person for anybody. Just try not to. And if I can do it, not eating all day, I'm pretty sure you can do it too. So that's my PSA for the day. 
and now I'm at the gym. So, oh, let's get these deadlifts on. Okay, bye.